that we wanted to do something to prevent, I guess, violent extremism from coming about. And the way we wanted to approach that was through community engagement. So there's 23 students, um, and as you can imagine, there's 23 different ideas that come along. Um, but we re really put our heads together um, and try to have fun with it and created a campaign that's both deep and personal to all of us. We want everyone to be able to speak up, that if there is something that's going on, we want them to know that as a community, we're there to support. We've hosted uh, information tables in three major cities of British Columbia, one in Vancouver, Burnaby and Surrey. One of the biggest things that we did was a series called Stories of Resilience. So we had a diverse amount of um, people that we interviewed from our communities, so local law enforcement, uh, we had refugees, immigrants, um, and just like established basically like everyday Canadians. We featured local talents as well as uh, local elementary schools. We went to their schools, provided them with the paint, and asked kids ranging from 6 to 15, uh, what do you guys think Canada means? And how is Canada inclusive? And what does diversity mean to you? What was surprising, I think, is um, how much work we put in in such a short amount of time. I think just stepping into this amazing space has really, um, uh, I guess, shown us uh, what a great opportunity this is for us. And we'll continue doing our story of resilience. We'll continue hosting the art gallery and turn it into a nonprofit organization. 